All right. Uh, before we get too sidetracked, I'm going to start off with a little deal here. So in Camtasia, we have this area called the canvas. And this is where all of our project material from the timeline resides. And this is where we can see what kind of editing and things we're doing. Well, if you're not aware of this, you don't have to stay inside the video dimensions right here. In fact, when we do things like animations from off screen, a lot of times your assets will reside outside of the video dimensions on what's called the canvas. And of course we can click on the canvas, use our mouse wheel to zoom in and to zoom out to get different views here. But another useful feature is what's called the pan tool. So let's say I wanted to like move this up even higher. Here I'm zoomed all the way out at 25%. That's as far out as I can zoom. But technically, the canvas is much bigger than this. Well, one thing I might do is click the hand and drag this over. I could actually move my view of the canvas around. But if I use the hand here to just move, what you'll notice is that I can't click on the image I want to edit unless you uncheck the hand tool. Okay, and now I can move it. Well, there's a kind of a simpler way to do that. If you press and hold the space bar, you can grab and drag around on the canvas. Let go of the space bar and boom, you're ready to edit again. Okay, a lot of people kind of get hung up. If you've ever used this little tool right here and, okay, then try to edit, well, you can't unless you uncheck it here. Use the space bar. Boom. Drag it, let go, and edit. There you go. Little quick tip. How many people did not know that little deal? It's almost like a, one of the hotkey shortcuts we can use, but uh, this used to make me crazy. And the same is true with the crop tool. You go into crop, and yeah, I can crop this, and I can move it, but you know, now I'm, I'm still hold. You gotta uncheck these. Deselect them. Okay? Right. How about that? 